Mark your calendars, parents. On Saturday, you can take your teenager to have their heart checked for deadly genetic conditions. This is a really big deal because you won't get a medical bill for it. Statistics show one in 250 students is at risk of conditions that cause sudden cardiac death. The heart tests are free at Dell Children's Medical Center for all teenagers 14 to 18 years old and not just athletes. KXAN Morning News anchor Sally Hernandez spoke with the doctor behind it all. What I thought was really cool about this event, too, is that these are tests and screenings that a teenager can get that normally maybe they wouldn't get at a, a regular doctor's physical exam, right? Correct. But this provides that extra layer of protection by assessing their electrocardiogram to evaluate the electrical properties of the heart and echocardiogram to evaluate the structure of the heart. That's a pretty expensive test to begin with on its own, right? I think. $700, but it's free that you're offering this. What exactly are you looking for in a teenager's heart? Well, we look at the left ventricle and the thickness of the left ventricle, um, primarily to exclude a condition called hypertrophic cardiomyopathy, which is the number one condition causing sudden death in athletes. I know that you've done hundreds of these screenings yourself. Have you ever seen a test and said, yes, we caught something before something bad happens? We have. We have we've do that on a regular basis. and It's really rewarding to be able to uh, pick up something like that and prevent a potential catastrophic result. Um, but I can tell you it's also rewarding for us and for these families when we can say to them, your tests are normal. You don't have any findings that would raise concern or worry. And a group organizing the free tests Championship Hearts Foundation says it screened more than 25,000 students since this program started in 2000. About one in 20 of those teenagers were referred for additional cardiac testing. The screenings are Saturday from 8 to noon at Dell Children's Medical Center. You need to register your student before heading out there. We set up a link for you to do that on our website, kxan.com. And on the subject of heart health, a new study has found that two naps per week can lower your risk of heart attack or stroke. Scientists observed 3,500 people for five years, and they discovered a nap or two, not, no matter how long or short, release stress from lack of sleep. Researchers say there's still work to be done on this study, though. By the way, if you're wondering just how long is the ideal nap, well, the experts say 20 minutes does the trick. And as always, we're committed to helping you learn more about your health along with our partner, the American Heart Association. For resources and easy tips to live healthier, go to KXAN.com and click on Simple Health.